Mr. Mayor, ladies and gentlemen, students and special guests, on behalf of Bridgen County Borough Council and Bridgen College, welcome to today's event marking Holocaust Memorial Day 2016. Every year we come together as a community to remember the millions of innocent victims who were murdered in the Holocaust and subsequent genocides in Cambodia, Rwanda, Bosnia and Darfur. We also pay tribute to those that survived all genocides. I feel extremely proud of Bridgen County Borough Council, its partners and you as representatives of our community continue to come together to mark Holocaust Memorial Day. This year's theme for Holocaust Memorial Day is Don't Stand By, from both a historical perspective and looking at what we can do now to not stand by. So many people risked their lives to save thousands of Jews. They stood up to help those being persecuted, including rescuing or hiding them, creating false documents or deliberately sabotaging railways. So many serve as inspirations, but the number of bystanders, those that did stand by, far exceeds the number of those who took action. We cannot help but wonder what might have happened if more people had taken action and stood up against the perpetrators of genocide. We can't all be heroes, but we can all try to make a difference to not stand by, as our fellow human beings are suffering. It's vitally important that we never forget and lessons are learned. We must do everything in our power to honour the victims of the Holocaust and subsequent genocides, as well as educate today's generation on the importance of preserving and passing on the memories. It is our responsibility to teach our children that hate, bullying, discrimination and victimisation is not acceptable and people shouldn't just stand by and allow this to happen. The Holocaust started with discrimination, which is something that still exists today. However, by working together as a community, we can ensure that hatred, discrimination and prejudice does not happen around us. Silence and forgetfulness allows prejudice and hatred to rise again. As you can see from the violence still perpetrated today in places such as Darfur, Syria and Iraq. Every one of us can make a difference in our communities if we hear and see prejudice and discrimination in our schools, our places of work, or out in the community, we can challenge it. We unite in our pledge to be committed to combat all forms of racism, discrimination, victimization, and prejudice. Together, we will never forget. We will speak out, we will learn lessons, and we won't stand by.